evening, everyone. I'm with the main Hello. man, the, you know, the free kick master. Yeah. Well, he's, uh, <laughs> taking free kicks is not the thing. Really. <laughs> Welcome, sir. Hello, you are right. back. Thursday yeah, nights, it's yeah. Dino time. Thursday is my time. Yeah, look, the moons can wait until Sunday when he recovers after our tournament. Oh, God, yeah. uh, that's hard. Hard. <laughs> but I saw his penalty. That was impressive, anyway, wasn't it? What? Moves his, didn't you see? Him? No. Well, you have to watch it like that. Pretty impressive. Moves. <laughs> so he's, ready, he's ready to go. Right. Okay, we'll preview Man City in a bit. Um, I want to get on to something that I, re- or I wanted to go on to, and we did discuss this a little bit on... Um, on Sunday, can we play Dean and Gray together in a team? Yes, I reckon we could. Yeah. But it would have to be it'd have to be on the floor if we were to do that. It'd yeah. have to be the way we're playing. Dean is going to have to because we have said um, Dean has got to get used to the way Silver wants to play. We know Dean is good enough, don't we? But if yeah. he does want to play with Gray, Gray's not going to. He's going to chase everything, but Gray wants it to his feet. He don't want Dini winning ahead, and then he, well, it would work running onto, but he's got to adjust to the way we're playing now, Dini has. Yes, yeah, it definitely. could work, but I wouldn't do it against City. No. I'd keep with the team they're doing. I'm afraid Dini's still yeah. got to sit on the bench. Cause well, I said that as well. We shouldn't be changing the No, side why should we? They're playing too bloody well. And no, uh, yeah, Dini could. It could work in the end, but I think he He's slowly getting there, isn't he? But yeah. He's got to adjust to the way we're playing now. It's as simple as that. Yeah. He can't be playing lumpy football to his head for the bloody time. No, Too no. many teams have gotten used to it now, haven't they? They love it, a defender. I love that. Yeah. We stick to what they're not yeah. used to, yeah, right, right, the yeah. way we're playing at the moment. You know. We play the way we are at the moment. We've got every chance of beating City at home this Saturday. Yes. I believe we could beat them 2-1. I thoroughly believe that our, good our team is. I only went 1-0 for this because yeah, of my right. predictions. No, no, that's not me sitting on the fence. No, no, it's no. because I said about the four-pointer. But yeah. I really, I go with an I the odd goal to win. win. Yeah. Yeah, I do believe we can win. And what, by the way, guys, hi, hi Lucy, hi, hi Siren, back in New York. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. I think he's, he's done about for this game, isn't he, Siren? I think, I think Siren's back for yeah, this game as well, mate, so really. enjoy it, mate. That's all I can say. Um, we, if you, guys, if you just joined, good evening. Um, we're talking about can we supplement Dini to play alongside Gray? Um, you know, tell us, tell us, guys, do you think there's a place for Dini and Gray in the same side at the moment or just throughout the season? So, Dini and Gray... Do you think they can play together throughout the season? Um, I would agree with you. Man City, we're not going to change the side, no, really, no, no, to no. be honest. They're um, playing too bloody well, aren't they? Dude? Well, midfield's never going to be changed yet. That's so Well, that, good. that is going to be the key to this game, is them three. Yeah. Them three get the ball and keep solid like they're doing. It's going to be one in midfield because yeah, it's silver. Yeah, it's going to be the them three are yeah. so important this game. They've got to be together like they have been. They've got to really gel. I'm mm. a bit worried for our defence. I don't know, you know, it's important for them to protect them as well, isn't it? I mean, who yeah. have we got at the back at the moment? Prodeal still nested, is he? Ah, all will be revealed when we discuss oh, our okay. team right. so then, right. oh, No, okay. no, but that's, he's not going to be there. I can oh, give you that one. He's not going to be there for that one. Um, yeah, yeah, no, Stuart, I do agree. Uh, we we stick, with the, stick with the guys up front for this one. During the season, though, do you believe that that's that could work? I mean, because... Gray could play as an could play as a forward, not an out and out striker. Yeah, he could uh, play on the right. I reckon it, it, it'll come to it in the end. I reckon the injuries might hit us in the end, and Dini and Gray will. I hope it don't, but Dini, and, no, it will work. Yeah. Once he option. get, like I said, he's got to get used to the way we play, and even he said that he's got to adapt to the way Silver wants us to play. But no, it's a great option there. You might get, even get a Kaka and Gray up top. <laughs> oh, San- Sanjay's put a good point. Four five one. When we defend, we play four five one. Yeah. When we attack, we play four three three. Yeah, we do pretty much. Aren't we? We're getting six or seven yeah. players forward at the moment, aren't we? Brilliant. And the midfield is an attacking midfield. Oh field. no. Yeah. Mate. With that shield, with cleverly. Who would you play as the one though? Well, it's a bit like that, <coughs> It'd be great for me. Hello, my mother's on. You know. My could be my, my um, <laughs> father, oh, yes. the David, the David of Atkinshire. <laughs> so. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, yeah I'd um, probably have Gray if it was the one up top. Which I, was I wouldn't. Of, I wouldn't change it. I'll just, no, I wouldn't. No. I'll just play like we we have that, and you know, I know we can't uh, have Brutus because he's suspended. I hope. So. Fair, fair enough. <laughs> City beat us, but as long as we play the football we're playing, if they beat us like you and me have said, 
so be it. But as long as we play our football, we've been doing from the start. On yeah. the floor, let's not go and start lumping it, panicking. Let's right. try and play. If they beat us playing better football, us, all right, fine. We'd be upset we lost, but at least we tried doing the football we've been doing all season. So yeah. Don't go, oh, let's lump it because these are better than us. Play the bloody game. There's a time to lump it, there's a time yeah, to there is. Not. Like you said, like, we do. like I said, if it's 20 minutes to go and we're losing 2 0 or 10 minutes, then you go to that. I take, play the bloody I take the evidence of Bournemouth when you know uh, when City went to Bournemouth yeah. and did that's not look that convincing. That's what's giving me confidence. Yeah. I would me. say half decent. They yeah, weren't not really decent, that. were they? And, and they nicked it late, didn't they? And we're a better footman inside the Bournemouth. Yeah, well, look what we've done, the Bournemouth. I know oh, we're not City, I would say we're more disciplined. Yeah, oh, God, yeah. Definitely more disciplined. Well, that and is, that's the other key, isn't it? Discipline is going to be massive. We've it's got that right. little bit more quality that could oh. unlock them. Oh, yeah, we've got a lot more. They didn't have... They no, didn't have that game. No, they're not as good now. No. Oh, my God, they're lacking a lot. See, their full-backs, City's full-backs, are going to have the life threat. Uh, they're going to have the well, life threat. Well, well, you and me were out. talking about Walker, weren't we? Because he gets caught a lot. We yeah. need to, I think we're the aim. What, what time is he going right back in it? Which awesome. Yeah, he goes, just stay up them. here. If he goes, so what? You're going to have so much space. He won't catch you. You're going to be goal side him every time. He's going to struggle to get back. Danny Elo, I think, would be better at marking um, Richarlson because they they put Carl Walker on him. Richarlson knows I hope Carl Walker to, does. I hope Carl Walker does. Yeah. We'd love it. Oh, I, I, I do believe Carl, Carl Walker's the number one. Yeah, there. they've got Bernard Mendy on the left. Yeah, um, yeah. Carrillo yeah. Can, Mendy, Mendy, Mendy is a pretty, is That's going to be good. good. Mendy is a good player. Mendy's better at tracking yeah. back. Yeah, yeah. Um, but it'd be that side, Walker's side, the right. Which that's going to be Carrillo's real acid test. And yeah. Charlson's with Carl Walker. Well, we're going to see how good our players really are, aren't we? So Walker is tough. Yeah. Tackler. He will yeah. try and test oh, yeah. him the first oh, yeah. few minutes. Says, well, Charlson, right, let's see what you can do you. when yeah. I smash you. Yeah. He's going to try that. And you know he's going to do it. He didn't at Tottenham. But, I mean, when I watched it from the outside, it looked brilliant. Yeah. You don't want it towards our. No, 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 no. Um, it's a full blooded. Challenge, but no, you, Silver's a smart man. Yeah. He's got ideas, and he's gonna he's gonna aim for. Well, I'd aim for that side if I was walking. I'd yeah. aim for that side. Well, he said he Every said time. I won't change a winning form, no. formula. No, we we'll play the way I want us to play. The identity we've set in stone now. So this is how we're pretty much going to set up the whole season. Yeah, Unless something disastrously bad goes wrong, and he obviously he's got a plan B under his belt. But why um, should he? change the way we're playing if we still get injured. Right. I don't stand plan B, of course you've got to have a plan B. He's, he said as well this week that first and foremost, survival is the key. To get that point, points and then push on. Okay, so Most teams four. do that, yeah. yeah. yeah the Swansea's, that. Yeah, I the, understand that. the West then, Broms, yeah. Yeah, I understand that. Of course. Get as many points as we can first. Or he's the target first. Solidify then, it. Then and on. then don't fall asleep in January, we'll be all right. Yeah. I hope that's, that's true. true. That's what we always do, isn't it? Great stuff. Then January comes. Yeah, no, I agree. Alan, I completely agree. We don't need to change our shape on Saturday. We no. need to be disciplined and patient. Yeah. It's going to be a wait. I agree with Alan. It's going to, like you see, it's going to be a waiting it, game. Yeah, it is. You know um, they're probably going to have more of the form than us. Yeah. But you know, against any team, I don't care if it's Real Madrid or Barcelona, you're going to get a chance or two. You've, you've just got, got to take it. Take yeah, it. you've got to take it. You're going to get a chance. Well, and we'll in, get chances. And in the big team. games... Against the United, against the Arsenals, you get probably two or three chances. Yeah. Against Arsenal, yeah, where we beat them yeah, away last season. Yeah, a couple and took them. And took them. You got to take them. Well, like you and me have seen, we watched it from here, haven't we? Bournemouth and um, Southampton, we were on top, and you and me both said we got a score here. And lucky they have, sure you know, because yeah. we said we got a score at this point. I like the fact we're taking long shots. Yeah, it's nice, isn't it? Instead of all the time. and they're actually going in. Yeah, that's nice as well, isn't it? <laughs> We're not taking tons of them, but out of so many, they're actually going in. Yeah, yeah. It's, they're yeah, getting it's, on target. We try to try tapping it in the net, don't we? And then it's like, well, let's have a pop shot. It's just an extra nice. dimension. Even if the keeper game. saves it, you know, it's just nice to see a long shot, isn't it? It's entertaining. Yeah. I think that's what Beanie needs to do a bit more of and all when he does try. Have a long shot. He's ball. got it in his locker. Oh, God, yeah. Jesus. He's God. got his locker. We just don't see much of it. Because he's he's one of those old fashioned centre centre uh, centre forwards yeah. that wants to be on the six yard box. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you know, you can understand that in a way. I'd um, like to see Gray banging a goal. Yeah, get his confidence up. Yeah, yeah. Well, not confidence up. Not but, confidence, you know, but you know, get him in that goal. Goal score. scoring I'd love confidence. To see him. Yeah, he's got the confidence. Oh God, to work yeah. Oh, you can see. Well, yeah. like you said with that. 
little um, flick against um, Southampton, you know, you can see he's confident, all right, that have the audacity to try that. Yeah. Absolutely brilliant. I, I, like I say, I, I still love his little back heel. Yeah, that was the That's one. Yeah, the yeah. one you mentioned. Yeah, that was great. Just bringing yeah. in others. Oh, just brilliant. If I can't shoot, I'll let someone else yeah. do it. You know. Right, guys, we're 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 trying to get we're trying to keep on the um topic of playing Deeney up front with Gray. Eventually, we're not saying like Man City on Saturday. We're just saying that just a general sort of question. We want to tap on this before we look into City. Um, well, I completely agree. We're not going. To, we we don't. We understand. We're not going to change any system. Everything. We we both agree that it's not broke. We don't fix it. We keep the same side pretty much that we had on um, Saturday. So you know, really no use, no <laughs> way of uh, changing that. Really, <laughs> and I put one all because we've. Drew one, Drew one. Yeah, well, even that's a good result, yeah. to be honest with you, isn't it? That's a, <laughs> it'd be great to even get a draw. I know that we can fill the thick with SC Cologne fans on Saturday, <laughs> Saturday and then they can shut City up. <laughs> I reckon we could possibly, if we went in at half time, 1 0 up, they would really panic, wouldn't they? Which I think is possible. I think it's more than possible. Yeah. But again, it's going to be do as a start if we. Don't mark properly, which is good. You don't so start far. badly, it's going to be a long Yeah, after, yeah. Long if they score it? in the first 20 minutes, it's going to be a, well, it's going to be hard anyway, but it's going to be even harder then, isn't it? <laughs> Won't be chasing the game necessarily, will we? But are we yeah, going to sure. still have that discipline yet? It's I reckon week. we could. We've done it against Liverpool. Didn't we? well, we've got Mark, so. Mark and um, Louise have joined. Um, so hello, Mark and Louise, hello, and Mark Michael and, Louise, and Alan. We obviously Watford Steve as well. <laughs> and I know Alan has added his. Um, 50 pencil wreath. Cheers, mate. And Sanjay. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, just keep adding your opinions, guys. We'll be putting out topics pretty much like a forum. And, you know, if you're new to this, just just start, just answer. Put your topics on and we'll talk about them and we'll highlight them in, in this. But we agree that De- – we could agree that Deeney and – yeah, hello, Dad. Yeah, we've got to give him the thumbs up as well, Mr. David of Atkinshire. Um, we, we pretty much agree that Deeney and Gray could – could yeah, work I reckon in the future. In the future. In the future. Yeah, Deeney will get it. I reckon a Kaka's got more chance of getting ahead of Deeney at the moment because yeah. he looks more like that player, to be honest with you, as it's a feet more. Kaka, I was really impressed with yeah, that. No, yeah, I'm yeah, really, yeah. I feel sorry for the guy. Yeah, but he looked more like Silver's sort of play, you know, to his feet. He always comes to it. He wants to bring it down. I know, um, I'm not saying Deeney. Well, so we know Deeney's. Well, Carlson right. and Carrillo running on now. Yeah. Yeah, it's right. perfect foil for him. He can hold them up. Yeah. Not saying great on. Just look, uh, looking at a kaka, he can. He's that big lump. He can hold it up. Yeah. How do you play against City though? Know, do you bring in a big lump to hold it up, or do you play on their shoulders the like Ray? Oh no, yeah. Can you just you start with how we always start yeah, the always. last few games? Yeah, the, and just have them on the bench. Another one I hope it. that plays for City is Stones because he's very vocal. Oh God! Isn't he? He's, he's used... closing down quick. Yeah, he's got close well, on his down. shoulder. He's great. Yeah. He's gonna be a great player. He is gonna be a great. Yeah, player. no, I agree as well. Let, yeah, Alan, I, I agree. Let's get Silver out. We haven't won since Saturday. I think, yeah, <laughs> definitely. Let's get that. Let's get. Let's get him out, mate. I tell you, I'm. I'm sick and tired of this. Careful with that family. No good. God, Jesus. <laughs> yeah, these, they probably said right. We, the, the, the There's a rumour going round. The, the, the board <laughs> meeting. They said right. You ain't won since Saturday. They made a good point there. Oh, <laughs> Yeah. We'll know it against them. <laughs> Michael, um, yes, I'm going to say yes. Will he be here? Will Dini be here in January? Yes. The way definitely. the way it's going yes. at the moment, him not playing. Yes, I think so. Yeah. Still weak. I yeah, still I'll think. Yes. I reckon he'd have played a couple by then. <laughs> yeah. Save him for the FA Cup. <laughs> Save him for the FA Cup. Yeah. Oh, I want to see him play. I really do. I don't want to see him. Might no, be. David. What's that? No, damn you! <laughs> don't get the <to> boring. <laughs> <laughs> right, I was going to say thank you for the news reports there, but you just completely yeah, so wiped you're that down here. You're no, going you're down here, mate. Right, Even your right. news articles about everything Watford is not going to save you from this. <laughs> and is, is, Susan Johnson has joined. Oh, God. Oh, There's Susan upstairs. She's up there. She's up there. <laughs> oh. Right, okay. The, right, Kabul's obviously ruled out. They've ruled out Kabul. Um, oh, really? Britos is not playing because he's still serving his two-game yeah, ban. Um, Zerai has made his way back to fitness. We'll touch on that a bit more yeah, later okay. on. That's with the under-23s. Um, um, Pereira's um, Cabaselli. Oh, Cabaselli. Yeah, yeah, yeah Cabaselli's all right. He impressed. I'll tell you what, he impressed me. I've seen a lot of him. Firmino's been back training. He's looking well. 
Oh, oh that, oh, that's, that's really good It wasn't news. as bad as it first oh, caught, good. so that's, that's, that's really quite, good news now. Yeah. Obviously, Prodil still misses the game. Um, Varg, Varg, or Varg, how do you um, pronounce it? He's had two internationals, and he I came in last Friday. It's so it's too much for him, Sky. Yeah. I, I think it'll be a bit too much. Have him on the bench. Yeah, I'd have him on the bench. Because if being Max is getting too. run ragged, then put Varg on. Yeah. Because he, he's yeah. fully fit because he's playing. Oh, yeah, I understand that. Actually. I just think this one will be too much for him. I think maybe the next game, who's that Swansea, he might be able yeah. to get a chance there, but not this one. Uh, yeah, I'll probably give Maps his chance with them. Um, yeah, Alan, Alan, he's waiting in the rings, Alan, I believe. What about um, the other one? Um, is, is he, is he, no, is the... Yeah, that's another thing. We'll put it right. Here we go. Under 23s, they beat Burnley 4 2. Um, they've won now, won three out of four. Um, Siegel played. So, yep. right, he scored a blinder in the top oh, corner. Yeah. Good. That's He's good. back. Good. And we had Pereira and a, I think Britos was watching from the stands or something. Well, no, Pereira and Britos apparently watching from the stands. Yeah. Um, you had him. He scored a blinder. Um, and I'm trying to read who he has scored. Sinclair got on the score sheet. Oh, really? Again, oh, well, that's nice, dude. Believe yeah, And another youngster, Pereira. Oh, oh they're good. Yeah, the, yeah, yeah, the youngster. Yeah. The two of the youngsters got on the score sheet. That's good. Um, you think he'll bring some of these youngsters through, Silver, in the end? I think that's one of his remits. I think it's just trying to establish ourselves, get the yeah. identity done, and then and it's easier so, to bring him in when we're winning. Oh God, so yeah, way yeah, we know that. Now. It's not so much pressure on them, is it? We're losing. So it's, it's necessity last year because of the injury crisis. Yeah. Now we don't have to rush him. We can just ease them in yeah. if we need to. Oh, it's good to hear Sinclair score that one. Also. Yeah, Sinky, Sinky's oh, back on the score sheet. He's, he's not going to get in. Dave. The moment, is he? Yeah. I'll cover it. I mean, I agree with Mudinho. Who, 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 we can let him um, elaborate on this a bit more on um, Sunday. Um, Cavaselli, yeah, Cavaselli will be singing the chorus song all game. Yeah, <laughs> he's still probably still got it on in his head now. But I tell you what, we'll be singing Cavaselli songs soon. The way he's the way he's turned up because he he's really going song because we've mentioned quite rightly we've mentioned the core and the midfield, yeah, yeah, and the, the Holy Trinity that we've got yeah. in midfield at the moment. But, Cabaselli's been very unsung. Yeah, he impressed me against you know, Southampton. He looked, he looked solid. I don't think he put foot wrong, does he? He was yeah. everywhere. He was absolutely fantastic. Another good young player. Yeah, let's put this team. question out. Who's got, who, we, we said this on Sunday, but we'll put it out again. So we'll use you, Ab, and um, uh, before I say that, hi, hi Richard. Um, who gets dropped for Pereira when he's 100% fit? We've no touched one. on this on the thing. No one at the no moment. One. He's on the bench. Yeah, he's on the bench. No that answers that question, Michael. But no, no, we'll put it out. Who do, who would you in the next few games if you if you put in Pereira? Who would you who would you drop? Well, you and me had this discussion. If we had to, it'd be cleverly, but that's only if we had to. It's yeah, not picking on him because he's fantastic we? again. You know, yeah. that was our choice. When I think uh, Moody Moody say Shalabo, I really disagree with, but that's Moody's opinion. He could be right. But <laughs> yeah. Spit. Yeah, it'll be on the bench. Yeah, no, we're yeah, not trying yeah, to win the team. I think we're sort of unanimous. It was last time we discussed this as well. Yeah, tough. Yeah. yeah. Why, um, why, like I said, why change it? That's it's important. a good question, Michael. We have touched upon it, but it is a good question. And um, I would, we've already said no. He waits. He waits his turn. He's on the bench, and he's a very, very good <laughs> problem to have when you've got a 15, <laughs> 16 million pound winger on the bench. <laughs> Yeah, but he's back. That's the one injury news. I'm just having a look at it. Yeah, he's turned up. Well, Varg turned up on tr- um, on Friday, like I said, and he's had two games on his belt, and he's had some full training. Yeah, no, so right, good. he's eased his way back in a yeah, full training. Another quality player. Yeah. Um, Where does he go again? He's another one because our bench is so coming so strong, isn't it? I know. It's, it's scary. Hey, they're sticking with wing back, Chris. <laughs> Stick him in centre half, he'll get straight I think straight um, back in. Colin put something just recently on Facebook saying on. what would are very dangerous. I think it was Adam Brazil that said that for City going. Was it Colin that put it on there? Good shot, mate. He, good shot. Yeah. yeah. He said what would are very dangerous. So we need to be careful, which is a great compliment, isn't it? Yeah. Well, we are dangerous every well, game. We must be doing something right because Talk Sport are giving us decent, oh, God, decent yeah. shouts. Imagine out they won't put us up any harder in bottom. That is shocking. <laughs> snobbery, we beat City, it's we'll, football snobbery. We beat sorry. City, we'll finish, th- we'll be third in the Yeah, the problem is if City hammer us, I bet we're bringing second or something if we get hammered. I'm not saying we will, but I bet we will. That's the sort of thing it happens because yeah. it's City play. If 4 0 hammer, I'm not. So no, 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 no. 4 0 no. hammering, then we get put first yeah, on match of the day. Yeah. First oh, or second. Yeah, of course it will. 
Oh, we know Zerati would take longer, but he, it's looking he's looking good. He's getting he's getting himself fit. He's scoring goals under twenty three as a side. He's scoring goals now, and he's, the confidence is looking good. I'm I'm happy because that's another well, headache when he's back. Well, right. Um, right. Quick thing. Apparently, um, I'm trying to look at me notes here. Danon Lewis, who's gone on a season long loan to Crawley, who is managed by ex under twenty threes. Coach Harry Kew, oh, really? um played his first start in a goalless draw against Stevenage this okay. week. Um, yeah, like I say, so just shout out to him. So that's another good youngster. Luck. Yeah, um, luck, like, no, no. Oh, we might as well loan, loan the load to Harry Kew anyway because he knows him. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah, it's decent a good level. Idea, just yeah. loan three Might be the reason he done it. Yeah. Yeah. He knows the way we play. Give him three or four, son. It. Give him three or four and just let him say, right, we know you. Def- we know he can develop under Kew. Just. Yeah, no, good at a decent level. Yeah, yeah. Tough all so, get experience. No, yeah. Fair play, Danon. Uh, good luck for the season, yeah, mate. Good luck and to you, mate. A nice little uh, thing. If he comes back look, looking good, we'll see if we can sneak him in at all. Yeah, why not? At least we can say well, then it'll look good on us because then we're farming these players out on loan and they're coming back better players. Yeah, no. That's why you do it. Yeah, there is. Don't yeah. You? you can't just keep them and let them rot, do you? you it benefits the team they go out on loan for, but also in long term, hopefully. Benefits us in the end if they get good. If not, you just sell them. Well, don't you? We're after apparently we're after from locomotive um, locomotive uh, NC and um, this mate uh, Maya Lovo Lovo Maya Croatian yeah. midfielder. I've just put it on here. Another, just put it on midfielder. Midfielder. Another <laughs> midfielder. We're looking at him. Um, depends where he wants to play. But apparently, How much you Everton know? were looking at him because of all the, the couple of players they've already not brought. Really. Um, we're bad. apparently looking at him, but do we need him? No, Not really. We need could. defenders. Well, well, no, we just signed two more, haven't we? But I'd always want a couple more midfielders yeah. and tackles. We got enough. Our injury yeah. crisis is just re- starts. It's just in the defence at the moment. Yeah, it is. Yeah, I know. Rather than all over the pitch. Yeah, so no. If you can stay in defence as long as long as it wants, if, it, <laughs> if we have to have an injury crisis, just stay at the back, or get all the guys fit then and have one or two in the middle. Yeah. 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 No, it's, yeah, it's just the other defence, isn't it? Right, let's get, let's get to the layers. Well, well, how are they doing? It? Right, um, Fran Kitchen, I'm trying to look at my notes again. <laughs> Fran Kitchen, Marisola, Bajardi have been called up to the England under 20s. Oh, really? So, oh, brilliant. Well done, girls. Yeah, so no, that's good. Lady. Yeah, no, internationals are a load of place. We saw those two um, Welsh internationals. Yeah. A couple of girls, and we got um, a girl on loan from Chelsea. Um, I do refer to just as girl. We will get the names. So I do apologise <laughs> yes. about that. Just say girls. Um, we've got one of them from Chelsea on loan. She's played for the under twenties in the past. Um, we've got a couple under twenties in the. League. So good. We've got yeah, some internationals playing for the show. Interesting, that isn't it? Yeah. How are they doing in the league? Do we you know? Roughly? No, but no, Sunday no. I will try and grab as yeah, much information, try, yeah. give them a good like ten minute shout out, and try and discuss a bit more. Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll Look try and it, integrate yeah, as right, much yeah. as we can, guys. Well, it's supposed to be half an hour, but we're just going to carry on until we stop. Um, <laughs> half an hour to an hour, so just keep keep them coming, guys. Um, yeah, so Sil- like I say, Silver, and- Silver is determined he's not going to change the winning culture. Why? You, you, you wouldn't anyway. It's just no, stupid. He'd be, be mad to. Um, he's focused on survival, and but he's keeping lid on his expectations. Basically saying, like I say, he's looking, he's keeping, keeping it straight down the line saying like want to survive. yeah we want to establish it we want to survive first take each take each step yep at a time so that's the first step survival first step second is, step is build on it yeah. pretty much give us a give us a nice cushion to not be under pressure to get the points all at once yeah we're getting them all throughout a period yeah rather than losing doing the ball and losing four games yeah, under no, panic no, it's not right no. we've got we've already got was it eight points? Yeah, twelve. Not bad. Yeah. Five, We've got a few, a few <laughs> points on the start, so yeah. yeah. Nearly caught in the way already. So. <laughs> Unbeaten, three clean sheets. Yeah. Taking away the Liverpool one, three clean sheets. So. Oh. Go well, and Mr. Burgess, Nicholas Burgess, oh. is on there. Nicholas, hello, hello sir. <laughs> hello. Good evening. Focusing on survival. <laughs> Look, uh, that's, Alan's just put up a good point. You know, we're not saying. I mean, he's not exactly saying we're going to win the league, but no, no. It's the, it could be a good attitude to go over. You look for survival, get the points as quick as you yeah, can. Yeah, yeah, try and get before Christmas. Because by the, t- by the time by Christmas, we've got forty points. Bloody Brilliant. hell! Yeah, the confidence. 
sky we'll look up, up rather be looking down. at Europe, mate. If you yeah. get forty points by Christmas, there's no point why not looking at maybe six or so. Fifth or six. I know we're not Leicester, but Leicester no. won the league. No, I said they're an outstanding team. Yeah. Come on, they just and dare to dream because we could go top if we beat C. And I, always, I went on my soapbox on Sunday about this, but just dare to dream because we can go top. I, I, I'll tell you what. I just just think it's a sorry, mate. I just think the scenario. You know, it's especially me walking into work, being top of the league. <laughs> it's a bit like, oh, yeah. yeah. I'll be walking. I won't even have to be nurse's uniform. No. I'll just have to be shirt for the whole I'm day. I'm to wear this. I'm just for this, yeah. <laughs> just one week, please, guys. Just give us one week on top of the league. So we can just walk <laughs> the whole week, Saturday to Saturday. Oh. Tag so every mate. I mean, you know? every mate, every night. Like, <laughs> table. Come on, I said, I've got to go. I've got to go. Even now, I'm going oh, yeah. in and asking about having um, hearing tests and stuff for vertigo because we were so high up the table. I said, I'm already, I'm already getting me, I'm thinking about getting my passport ready for the Champions League. <laughs> now, I'm starting to watch the Champions League a bit more just yeah, to get so a feel what yeah, it's so like, you know, what sort of times like. I've got to make sure I'm, I, I'm not doing something. So the gym had to be, might have to be I'm switched. I'm fully confident we can beat City. I'm fully I'm, confident. I'm no. fully confident we could do it. We beat City and I'm fully confident we won't get Barcelona or Real Madrid in our Champions League group next <laughs> season either. So, you know, as, uh, you know, I'll drink to that. You know, we'll probably get CSK Moscow or something, but a nice trip to Moscow. Lovely. Moves can drive me. Yeah, moves. Yeah, I don't want to drive. You can drive moves. Yeah, I don't want to drive to Moscow. We might have to. We might have to fly because I don't think you'd drive all the way. No, to Moscow, I don't think you would. I think moves want to have a few drinks Mos- as well. I think moves might. Yeah, have yeah, a few doing beverages. A beverage, <laughs> alcoholic beverage. <laughs> might have one or two. That's it, mate. Right, let's get on there. Right, we've touched on a lot of it about City, but let's get on to the thing about just focusing on City, Man City. Not all, how we go causing problems yet. <laughs> Not just on Man City yeah. and the danger men in your eyes. Uh, amongst many. Well, one one of my favourite players is Silver in midfield. Yeah, I was going to say. If he that. runs, Decore is and Shalabar have got to stop him. And cleverly, that's going to be a real tough task to stop him. Yeah. Because he is. He, I know he's not doing much alone, but he still is a world class player to me. Magnificent player. The other one has to be Aguero. I know he's not in a few any, but he, with us, he always scores headers past us, though, hasn't he? Yeah. Which, like you said, is ridiculous. When there one game where there was three of our defenders and he still out jumped them, it was, was that two, two seasons ago. It, it was, was I think them, it might have been Kafka and Bretos. Yeah, and it's ridiculous. Yeah, all he's the twin, and he just jumped up right behind, beside him. And I mean, okay, the Yaya Torre one a couple of seasons ago was a, cra- a cracking yeah, goal, yeah. but whole bass. You don't want to land batting, but Holbach took a step back. Yeah, which is you can't take a step back against players like that because they will wrap their foot round like he did. It was a fantastic yeah. strike. Maybe he might not have got him, but he would have been more pressure. Yeah, yeah. No. <coughs> the other two, what's his name? Um, Jesus, Jesus. Or Jesus. And I know he's not great at the moment, but Sterling, he's just can, you know, I know we've got pacey players, but he can still be dangerous at the moment. And he's banged in a few goals, hasn't we've he? We've got our lad for some Benfica. Yeah. This goes on, don't it, mate? You could probably name a couple, right? Or haven't. Yeah. I mean, guys, do you think City are going to win the league? I've said yes. I think City are going to, be the, the, going to win the league. Yeah, I'd be up there, mate. Alan's mate. pretty much um, highlighted that? that with Hazus and yeah. um, Silva being the key men, yeah. yeah. I mean, company, yeah, like company's managing to stay on the pitch for more than five minutes, so. But I'd aim for company because he's a brilliant defender, but he's getting slower, isn't he, don't you think? He gets caught a lot. Yeah, that, um, if Gray could just keep Graham doing what Charles he's there. doing, because I believe he, he is going to get this whole side track right. You know, so what is going to happen? He will get one of he's these right. drop of the shoulder yeah, away from the Yeah, that's it. Approval, and the company yeah. will not catch him. No. Well, if he does, it'll be a red card, because he won't get the ball. Gray will be off. Yeah. Like a shot. I really hope we don't play Daniel or Cash. No, I really hope not. Cause Unless I it's a sort of plan B. Unless it's a plan B, yes. But uh, not from the start. I really hope not. It's a, it's a bloody good contrast. Because I write the game off straight away. It's a good contrast from last year, though. Thank God we're not. I mean, last year was just a write off. The whole game was a write off. Oh, that was pathetic, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. We didn't look proper, didn't we? <laughs> no. To be honest, City didn't look like they got out first gear because they didn't have to. They no, they so didn't poor. have to. No. Absolutely. This year we're unbeaten. We ain't conceded in three games. We're, we're, and they, like I said, like you said, Alan Brazil is right. Yeah. 
City have got as I mean, City, City all of them will have to be every team yeah. on Saturday. City have to be on their game because respect, we can beat them. Respect this time. I yeah. said we've seen it every game. It's not one or two players bombing up. It's six or seven. Yeah. I'm glad. Yeah. Look at the options we've got here. It's almost impossible not to find a pass, even if it's going backwards. It's like look at the pace, and they get back quick enough as well. They're quick enough to get back if they get the ball, don't they, and recover in numbers. The team plays a 4-5-1 defensively, and it works as a solid... It don't look like it when we're playing. Really. I know what you mean, it is, but it don't look because like... Because we're attacking attack. so many times. Yeah, it's just... You don't notice. They don't know what they're doing. Like, like I say, if you can play that way, as long as you can, as long yeah. as you can attack a certain way. Yeah. You know. Oh, so we, you won't... If we play like that, six of them attacking them, City will not be used to it because they're not used to team. Because we're not lumping it forward now, no, we're playing with pretty yeah. much six players bombing forward. Yeah, yeah it's brilliant. Yeah, and they're fit enough. Yeah. By saying you um, get Southampton, don't we look fitter than most teams? We look fitter than Bournemouth. Not because we won. It's not because we won. We just look sharper, quicker, stronger. Always getting to the first ball, getting to the second ball, we can get to the third ball. And also it helps Just, getting that goal at the right time. Yeah. Because yeah. it maintains that energy. Yeah, that's right, yeah. And that willingness to be there. I mean when you're winning or you're playing you well find extra you, energy. You don't find you? you find extra time to get to cut out that ball yeah. or make that pass yeah, right, or yeah. push up. You're not sort of putting the, you're having your foot on the ball, looking up. And saying, oh, God, what do I do, what do I do? Yeah, that's right. Go. Yeah, no, when you're winning confidence. When you've got confidence, right. everyone knows that. You play five aside to professional oh, yeah, level. Yeah. You've got the ball at your feet. You've got confidence. You will make that extra effort. Yeah, that's right. Forward. Yeah. Press on. You're not that worried. Oh, God, what if I miss this? Yeah, no, no, you're work. not thinking like that. Yeah, when you're losing, like I said, it's different. But well, it's when you're hot, winning, you find extra it's, energy. And it's not a hot potato theory no, as well. Where everyone you're want, everyone wants it as well when you're winning, doesn't they? Everyone wants the ball. Yeah. Now, if we play our football, we've got every chance of beating them. Does, have they been tested yet properly? Everyone having the doubt of them? I don't think so. Yet, I think. Oh. They hammered Liverpool because they had a man sent off. That pretty much killed the game, didn't it? And it's at C. Up time. Yeah, it was at C. This is at Watford, our place. Yeah. If it was at City, I might have said we might be able to nick a draw. But as we're at home, I really do think we could win. Yeah. 2-1, I reckon. I, I, yeah, I mean... I reckon it's, we all reckon it's possible, don't we? we it's good that um, Ziegler's had two under-23 run-outs because that means he, he's almost fit and ready yeah, to go. Yeah, no, that's good. And he could be on the bench on Saturday as yeah, well. Yeah, why not? If Stonesy, like, like a movie said, if Stonesy plays against against us... Stonesy and like company. Yeah. Rich, imagine Richarlson and um, Carrillo running out. Even, like I say, even Gray. Even Gray, the Gray shoulder. No, slow bloke, is he? Jesus. Um, being with Stones, I'd play like you said, right tight, because he don't like lumping the ball, does he? He always wants to pass it out. So if Gray or any of them can just stick with him all that time. They can nudge up. him off. He does himself. not. Yeah, he does not like. like which him, which is good in some ways, by Stones, but he always yeah. does a cock up. He panics. Yeah, he does sometimes. He yeah, panics. he does. He really, really does. Be on he put enough pressure on that guy, and like I said, like you said, company doesn't like people running no. out. No, he loves it in the air. If he was to play against oh. company, would prefer playing against Deeney and Olympic football. Company would be in his element there. Yeah. But for some quick players running at him, he go, no thanks, I don't want that. No, I better not. I really don't. No, I reckon um, Silver would be the main deal. Thank you, man, for Silver. Silver. You've got to stop him from getting the ball. You've got to try and take him out of the game. Because you look at the midfield, um, and you see you can play Jesus and playing alongside Aguero. Yeah. But I, th- I know they've been trying to flitter him about. You've yeah. got Sterling. Yeah, there's, uh, like I said, it's, it's quality. It's pace around, up there. Or... Their defence is their weakest part. So it's nothing. We shackle them in field, it's going to be one. Yeah. Yeah, it's we not like what you and me said, it's going to be Decore, Shadaba, and Clevy that's going to win us that game. If them three play like they've been doing and stop City, we've got yeah. every chance. Yeah, it's, they're, they're going to be, uh, we can beat them with that. Yeah, that midfield can. will stifle them. We'll stick with any team in the Premier League in that midfield. The, like I said, the pace we've got but is I think, quality. I think they're pretty much champions elect this season. I reckon, oh, I've said both Manchester teams will be going for it. I reckon United Chelsea. will be up there. Yeah. Chelsea maybe, yeah. I reckon be and the Tottenham. Manchester team. Yeah, Tottenham. Tottenham will be Tottenham the they, fourth out of the three. Yeah, four. probably, yeah. Yeah. They die out, don't they? Every, always near the end, they seem to pop. We've got up, Everton will go back up there, so you'll be, it'll be like, um, you've got Arsenal in the mix as well. Yeah. Arsenal, you've got like the likes of Everton, 
Liverpool, Arsenal, mm. Chelsea, Man- the Manchester. They're all looking the six in it. Yeah. Six in it. Top six. That's the team I want to play. I know we're playing them three weeks, four weeks, Arsenal. They're yeah. vulnerable at the moment. That's, we won't get to that now. Arsenal but that's at home team especially. I, would, yeah. I can fancy us to beat them a decent yeah, score. They're, they're, they're vulnerable, aren't they? They really are. They're not that good anymore. I mean, they played a, I mean people say, oh, they're back on track. They played a poor Bournemouth side. Nah, and even no, the no, Arsenal like, fans weren't convinced. No, nah, no. Nah. Even they weren't convinced. Well, they said, well, you Ian know, Wright we, said it. They're going to be judged this weekend against Chelsea, Arsenal, aren't they? We're Wright not judging them against the Bournemouth team. We're judging them against Chelsea. But, and it shows how far we've come because people are saying, our oh, real so judging, they'll us. judge us after City. Yeah, they used, they didn't, used to say that, did they? No. They would have said to judge us after Swansea. Yeah, home that's or right. Yeah, not now. They're judging in, us against the title contender. Or Sunderland away or something like that, you know. <laughs> yeah, it's against the title contender and the Champions League team. That's great to hear. It's a great compliment to Watford, isn't it? It, it really proves how much we've, how much we've come in the last short space of time. Oh, unbelievable. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Well, yeah. Right. We've got, right, if John Stone plays, yeah. Yeah, we said, right. Oh, ne- uh, I just want to say, Neil Price. Yeah. Neil Price, yep. ex Watford, Neil Price <laughs> has joined in as well. So if he's still on, hello, hello Mr. Hello. Price. <laughs> I Brilliant. remember you at Emerald Town as well, mate. Three <laughs> 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 of few Watford celebrities on yes. it as well. Hello. And moves. And moves, <laughs> and of course, moves. Moves. he's the main celebrity. Yeah, he's the main celebrity. Yeah, um, he was very thankful of anyone saying hello to him. Um, we'll say hello to many of you, but Mr. Neil Price, <laughs> hello, sir, you are a legend. <laughs> and yes, thank you very much, mate. But yeah, get in touch with us, mate. Um, we'll definitely set up something, set up video interview with you if you want, <laughs> mate. So I'm definitely going to try, be trying to do that. We were supposed to be doing it recently, but the software that I've got oh, is a bit crap. Yeah, the end, mate. We'll no, get there anyway. Yeah, we've got right. we've got a couple of others looking at it. So <laughs> my tech wizards, yeah. basically <laughs> me on a Thursday night having a look and trying to download <laughs> another equipment. That's basically what it is. We'll get there. We will get there very soon. Yeah, I mean, the comparisons, we'll draw more comparisons after Saturday um, from last season. It's not going to be much, there's going to be so many non-comparisons <laughs> because one one we're really good and one we're not. Yeah. Um, that's pretty much it. More disciplined, yeah. all together, yeah, everything's better than at the moment. Yeah, it's just as an attacking, but... Oh, you know, attacking is unbelievable. Right, midfield double. Let's have a quick look while we're chatting about something else. Midfield double, guys and girls. Um, who's your favourite midfield double? We've got the Holy Trinity, as I call it, the uh, the Hornet Trinity now, but a midfield two. Who's your best midfield two? And I'm going to throw a couple in. This yeah. is not an 80s Taylor one. It's a 90s Taylor one. <laughs> Jono and Hyde. There's a midfield two. Yeah, well, Tot- midfield two. <laughs> no. Best midfield two, guys. Watford midfield two. What, it's together? Or? Together. A mid- centre midfield two. Together. Johnson and Hyde. Yeah, that's pretty good. John and Hyde were absolutely quality. Um, yeah, that'll be my probably my two thing. better than it. <laughs> oh god, that's pretty good. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, <laughs> I'm thinking. I love Mika 80s. Hyde. I'm thinking Taylor <laughs> and Les Taylor. And who would you put me forward on? Oh. Les Taylor's another one. Yeah. Ravaging Hesse. I didn't want to do too many 95, 96, mate. I was actually going to put Painey and Painey and Ramage. Hesse. Tell you what, that is a uh, that is yeah, one of my. One, that's probably going to be my number two. Yeah. Ravaging Hesse. You know how much I'm. Yeah, I know you love Man Ravage. crush on Matt Ra- Ra- Ravage. He's one of the greatest ever players in my life. As far as I'm concerned, yeah, that would be. Um. Go on, give us a one from a separate era, but I'd rather you do two. There we go. Low and that's a, a really good shout by Stuart. Yeah. That that could yeah. be on most people's top two. Or top what top one. The, yeah, no, I'm going I'm going with John O'Hyde yeah, and then I'm I'm gonna O'Hyde. grab the yeah. see that could possibly be my top three. Yeah. Taylor and Loman. Yeah. But I wouldn't know Ramage and Hesse as well. It's like oh jeez. <laughs> yeah, John Owen Hyde. I yeah, just I love good. that midfield. Yeah. I thought it was brilliant. I love Mika Hyde. They're yeah. just yin and yang. Yeah. Heidi, I actually I just love, love Mika Hyde. Yeah. Mika Hyde was quality. Yeah. Yeah, I wanted I wanted a saviour after Ramage left, and I got him in Mika <laughs> Hyde. He was my next hero after that. Old Painey, he was such an unsung one. Him, Painey, in the 
in the midfield. Who else? Who else thing? Because I mean, like I said, we can't have this midfield now. But you had Gavin Mann. Yeah, Gavin yeah, Mann's yeah, another Gavin shot. Mann, yeah. Mann and Springy. Oh. Even the Springy. I love, I love Springy. Springy. Uh, Matt, what I'll throw another one. Mann and Spring. Oh, cool. Well, I did like Mann. So. I, I thought Mann was brilliant. Honestly. He was I'm, underrated, I thought. Yeah. Well, a lot of, not all Watford fans, but quite a few people didn't like him, well, did they? He, he seemed worked to have so a consistent hard. thing, but he just, he just, when he, when he was playing well, yeah. he was so relaxed. He weren't a class player, but he worked hard, didn't he? he it was a Ramage hard. mentality. Ramage sometimes was over relaxed yeah but he yeah. looked like a man where he just was just just oh well right, i'm not playing control. Seemed in control okay. yeah it didn't seem i've got the ball away boy you know just past it yeah midfield two Bring guys it. get yeah. these midfield twos in we've got some cracking ones already yeah spring was a good player and all that. springy yeah he was a quality player he was another one like i said my favorite player is shallowbird <laughs> right here's here's one now we've got the midfield two who would you Drop out of any era with Charleston and Carrillo, who would you replace them with? You can need, just replace one if you want, but who would you replace them with? And are, are, are the only two I'd replace them with is Callahan and Barnes. That's it. <laughs> Callahan and Barnes. <laughs> They're the only two that were. Barnes was one good of the good enough best to replace in the world, them, yeah. yeah. That's the only two good enough to I replace I love Dashley Young, but he's not good enough to replace them two, is he? In, in his Watford days. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Definitely young would have come close. Yeah, but actually, young uh, would come very close. Yeah, close, but not good enough to replace them two, is it? Right, who would you place Carrillo and Richardson with? Any era? So I, I love Deeney, but um, this is off the topic. I love Deeney, but he'll never be Cliff Holton. Nah. I know that sounds really yeah, no, 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 no. Even my dad would. Alan Nielsen and Micah Hyde. It's a good one. Yeah, Nielsen won a bad player, wasn't he? Barnes and Callahan to replace Carrillo and Richardson. That's the only thing in Pereira if we can. Yeah. There's that other lab we got from Arsenal a long time. Pab- Pablo Vanazza. Oh, oh, Pablo Vanazza? Yeah, he won a bad midfielder. Nielsen and Vanazza. Yeah, I remember that one, weren't it? Nielsen was the better player. Me out of the two. Oh, listen, yeah, he was yeah, a bit yeah, more classy, and he, he stuck uh, with us a bit longer as well. Yeah, he did. Yeah, but I don't think it worked out for <coughs> Vanessa a lot, really. Did he? Had the all Stuart, good game. But... Stuart Slater. Stuart Slater, yeah. Slater was, Slater was a decent, decent. Stuff. Yeah, Bar- yeah, that Stuart's thing. Barnes and Cali every yeah. time. Yeah, Barnes was our best ever player we've had, and he, without a doubt, and he, <laughs> yeah. without a doubt. I put in him, him. Barnes was probably our best player, but it's very close with him. Um, Holton, yeah, and Blissett, yeah, oh, of course, Blissett. But they were different, yeah, roles. Yeah, I mean, Barnes was more players, of a winger yeah. and wearing a straight forward, yeah, those three players, yeah. But yes, yeah, Slater. But who would you put, Dave? Then who would you put put Slater in place of then? I love, I'd love to see a John Barnes in this team now. Yeah, in this what the team now. <laughs> Where would you play him wherever he wanted? I'd you? love to see the explosion free kick. It's amazing. I vaguely remember them. Yeah. But a young kid, a very, 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 <laughs> yeah. very. And I want to get the picture of Barnes yeah. taking an explosion free yeah. kick. That one is iconic. Yeah. It's the one. It's, yeah, Barnes in his prime of the guys, and you could just see him spread out, <laughs> and Barnes takes it. It was one of the most favourite memories of the, ta- the Taylor era, was that explosion free kick. We made famous. That was Watford's. That was Watford's at her. Yeah, Barnes and Cali. Yeah, mm. I think we're pretty much settled. They're probably the, the only ones I would possibly be. Stuart Slater. It was just such a shame. Slater never really. It was near the end of his career, to be honest. Yeah. Um, but what we saw glimpses. Us, was it? We got Tony Daly was a show. We got him too um, late. I don't know. Yeah, he was a, I wouldn't put him in, but we got. No, he was, he was another one a we bad got player, late. was he? When he showed up, when he had yeah, a bit of class, didn't he? Yeah. I don't know why I always liked Norden Woodhow a bit. It's just a show we didn't take the ball with him. <laughs> but when he first when came he, away, yeah, when wow. he was first, yeah, I was like, bloody hell. He's just, he's just a good quality. Charlie Miller. Yeah. There's another, Charlie Miller's another one. In the um, that one Premier League season under t- Taylor. Yeah. yeah. Charlie Miller's a good one. 
but he was pretty much back up because uh, we tried to have John Owen Hyde. Yeah. But they were all, he, one got injured or the other. Yeah. You know, they were all out together. of form and stuff in the Premier League. So we never really saw what, how good they were in the Premier League. But oh, well, as a championship midfield, quality, right? one of the best midfielders yeah, in that league. Yeah. Just for consistency more than anything. We, they, like I say, we had one that was the skillful pass and the other one that took shots from 100 yeah, yards away. Perfect, yeah. <laughs> in the top corner. I wonder who that was. No. Yeah, right. <laughs> that wasn't Callahan. No. <laughs> yeah, but that, that, so that midfield is just poetry in motion anyway. So, you know, I don't think you get a better one than that. No, there's young, you can do it. Yeah. Yeah, the destroyer. Right, let's get back to this. If people didn't miss it, obviously we know Pro Deal's out. Britos is serving his too much ban, so we're not going to have them. Um, Varg has, had, Varg has been, he's come back, um, and he's had two Marley games under his belt, so we know he's fit, so he can, he can slot in if he needs to. Firmino is trained, um, so the, the injury's not as serious when we first fought, which is a relief. Yeah. Um, so we're hoping he's back. Daryl Yamat, I don't know. Um, Would you play for Mina in this game if he's fit? I'd play for, oh, I'd just put, play for Mina and I'll keep Holbach. Holbach really Yeah, no, he's been Saturday. good, hasn't he? He's been consistent, yeah. hasn't he? I'll keep he's it. very consistent. He has been good. Um, well, I'm glad for Mina's okay because he's been quality for us and he's a yeah. key player. Capacelli, the thing is, it's who you're going to put with Caselli rather than who's going to put with yeah, anyone else. Um, Capacelli. I can give him maps. Keep Naps in there. Yeah, he's, he's not said Varg he's played enough games. Varg hasn't in the Premier League. Put Varg, in the, put Varg on the bench. If it goes wrong, give him a chance. Yeah. But nah, Maps would be all right in the centre, wouldn't he? Maps you know is going to do a job for us because he's, he's a proven Premier League defender. Yeah, that's why I'd have him a head Especially at Palace. Not the greatest of size, but he's solid. Yeah, no, as long as he's got play good. coming round supporting him, which he will, for Mina and Old Bass, won't he? So it's easy to that's slot these players in because, like I say, we're, we're playing well. So it's, you know, it's yeah, easy, give yeah. Maps his chance with Cabasetti, yeah, why not? Yeah. That'd be fine against City. I think uh, Maps would enjoy the challenge. Yeah, marry up, yeah. Marry up and Cabasetti. That's all we've got the choice for, isn't it? Yeah. Right. Kanowskis and Gomez. Um, no one's going to dislodge. The man that is the Gomez at the moment. But <laughs> Pretty clean sheet. Can you? Right, how can you? <laughs> he was. He's ready. Yeah. He's ready. He's a very. Oh, I can say him him him. When do you bring him in? Not yet. Anyway, it's going to take an. In, uh, God forbid. I don't want this to happen. Nah. He's going to take bad form or injury for Gomez because he's not going to go he's in. He's going to have to concede like fifteen goals in three games or he's going to be dropped. Isn't he? Yeah. <laughs> I do believe we've got. Probably got shots in the FA Cup. Actually, I do believe we've got the keeper now to really good push point. Gomez for his last two years. Which is good, yeah. And he's yeah. going to become an agent around the year. Oh, really? He needs to get a decent agent this time. <laughs> Not one that's stranded by Sinclair on the train station, either. <laughs> nah, you can't drop, no, so you can't drop Gomez, can you? It wouldn't be fair, would it? Pre clean You Sorry, would if you carried him, he's a bit heavy. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You know, you can't stop him. Right. Right, that is, we're, we're exhausting this, uh, <laughs> exhausting this at the moment. Right. We are back on Sunday. Um, obviously, a lot to talk about with Man City. We'll Hopefully do a lot good. of good. Hopefully good. <laughs> Hopefully very nice. Um, and also, we'll be back after our Celebrity Soccer 6 tournament where me, the free kick man, which will be in free kick, will make us all go. If that, you like. see him at any games, eventually, just do ask him about his free kick record. <laughs> it's as good as his music. Well, no, it's that your music collection is actually better than your free kick record. Um <laughs> And Moves will be back, like I said, back on Sunday. He, we will be putting a couple of minutes about the tournament um, <laughs> and represent, represent uh, the Watford. But the TMA will be over there for Soccer 6. We're not actually called the TMA team. We will eventually put one in there because everyone knows Moves. <laughs> yeah, that's right. So yeah, it's, it's, it's technically a celebrity, yeah. to- it's a celebrity <laughs> at a celebrity tournament. Yeah. So that's good enough. Anyone I'm, asked, I'm just a twat with a mole, so it doesn't really make it's like a lot of celebrity for me. So, and Dino's got an ACDC t shirt, yeah, so right. that's enough for us. Right. <laughs> we'll see you Sunday, guys. Just keep adding your questions, and we'll cover them on Sunday. Put your put your topics on Facebook, and thank you very much. We had over 48 comments on this; it'd be absolutely amazing. Um, see you Sunday, eight o'clock. We will make sure we will be back in time because we did say cut off. Well, Moves is driving, so I think we'll be all right. <laughs> Mr. Moves is driving. So, <laughs> yeah, woo, he's here for the podcast. If we, we're not back in time, it's because of him. Um, so, yeah, 
you just warn him to say, look, don't drink, <laughs> don't drink or anything like that. You got drivers back, <laughs> right? Okay, guys, Tulu, have a good weekend. Up the orbs.